guys, welcome back. This is my Ipsy unbagging for the month of January. I'm super excited. Um, I did, I'm going to put it out there, I already did open these, but there's a reason. I was making a video and then everything got deleted. I'm like, oh my gosh. So this is like my third time making this video for you guys. So yes I know crazy right so this is my two ipsy bags in one I'm just going to th throw it together so it's like quicker and get it it gets done faster so if you don't know ipsy is a 10 month subscription unbagging with products with full sizes um, deluxe sample sizes I usually get deluxe and full sizes um, it's a really great subscription box for $10 there is pros and cons to this subscription I will um, give more of my thoughts towards the, the end of the video so let's get into it the month of January is the let's see theme is all eyes on you if you can see that it's really cute and then it tells you in the back how you can um, snap your snap your photos share them and possibly win a year subscription of Ipsy so if you don't know and if you do have you should know if you have Ipsy, you get you could sign up, you know, do those things and get a maybe a free year of subscription from Ipsy. So, anyways, um, the first thing is this Sky no Skin Iceland um, beauty towels or cleaning cloths. They are, have ten cloths in here. Usually, I believe in a when you go to the store and you buy a little packet like this usually it's like 20 of them I believe in a packet so this is a you know a good size deluxe I think this is a deluxe I don't know I would have to go on the site and see if this is a full size um, but this is a really good you know so you can try them out and you know see what you like that is one product and remember this is two bags so, and then my next one is this smudge te technique. Um, it's by Bean Cafe Cafes. I can't even say because it's so tiny, so it's like I can't even see it with my. Because I wear glasses, so right now I'm like half blind, if you know what I mean. Women that have glasses, and then this is a smudge. I actually think this looks like my MAC 217 brush, but so I could, since I have hooded eyes, I can actually probably use this as my crease and then maybe smudge it out if I really want a smoky eye, which I've been doing more smoky eyes and different looks this past month. So this is a really good brush. So this is a full size. So that's two. The next one is... The Lasting Smiles Organic Lip Balm, and this smells like, if you've ever had um, hot chocolate and peppermint, if you melt the peppermint in the hot chocolate, that is what it smells like. It smells like heaven, especially with the snow on the ground. I really like it because it just reminds me of winter and just all the good memories with winter. <laughs> so, and I've actually um, put this on my finger and it's so like I don't like to use this word but on YouTube but moist and creamy and just very I know it's gonna work and this is an organic and I believe um, I was um, really doing research and this is a uh, they give some donations to children with um, just children with deformity I think clip lips lips so if you don't know what that is go check that out okay so that's three my next one is the hey honey open your eyes eye contour lifting fluid 
and I don't exactly know what this is yet. I will have to do more research, but it, the way it sounds is it contours under your eyes and makes it more of a lift so your eyes are not drooping all the time and it's just for your under eyes so that's four sometimes I get messed up so if I like count overly than what it is just leave a comment below so this is the J Cat's blink oh blinkle shimmer eyeshadow and this is a pretty color I used to used to wear this type of color all the time before I got into like more of the makeup world on my eyelid and this is such a pretty color for blue eyes really pretty I think this would be um, pretty for green eyes as well my it face is itching sorry guys but this is really pretty bronzy bronzy red this actually reminds me of I just thought about this. The one of my Makeup Forever Pro eyeshadows that looks almost pretty much exactly like that. I'm gonna swatch it for you guys so you guys can see what color it is. Such a pretty color. Look at that. I'm gonna swatch it. And it's pretty pigmented. Yeah, that looks almost pretty much really close to my makeup forever. I'm going to actually use these and see how they, so I need something to wipe my hands off. Oh, they really, ooh, these are like, they're not dried up, that's for sure. So, yeah, I'm going to probably like that. Ooh, that comes off right away. Okay, so that is what it looks like, very pigmented. Um, so that's five products. My sixth, sixth one is the City Color Eyeshadow Trio. Really pretty colors. Let's see. I don't want to get my... So, if you can see, those are the colors. I'm going to swatch them. The brown's really pretty. If you can tell, they're really pretty. Just a really cute look for the fall time. They are pigmented, but they're not pigmented as the Makeup Forever or like Makeup Geek. They're a really good quality, but I wouldn't say they're as good as, you know, the th trio, not this one. This one really is smooth and blendable and really nice so that's the sixth one okay so I got two of these these are the balm mr. right now eyeliners I got two I think I'm gonna do a giveaway with that so let me show you it reminds me of a light bronzy gold grayish color if you can, can see that and it is shimmery a little bit it's not a full matte and it is actually smudge proof like you can't move it look at that it's not going anywhere like it's really good I love how it stays once it stays once you put it on it's gonna stay so you can't like put it over your eyelid so remember that ladies if you have that you can't once you draw it on it's not going anywhere so I would put it like underneath you know your eyes doing like the lower eyes okay so my next one is the Perlis Blue Loftus 4-in-1 I Adore Serum and this is for um inten intensive hydration Firms, brightens, and decrease puffiness. So, that is what it looks like. This is a pretty good size sample to try. So, yeah. And then the last one is, I like these products right here. These are the Tressies Mini Matte Lip Crayons. And oh my gosh, I love this color. I don't know if you can see it, 
but let me get a swatch out for it, you guys. This kind of reminds me of my the Balm Matte Mousse Liquid Lip Lip Liquid Lipsticks and in the um in committed I think and this but this is more a little bit little bit mauve mauvier so I love this shade very beautiful I think that's seven I wasn't counting with the last one um I love that shade I really like these lipsticks because um, a lot of people don't use the full size unless you're really addicted to a certain lipstick and you use it like daily and constantly. You're going to use some, but you're not going to probably f use the full. So this is a really good size. Let me show you how much you get. You get a pretty decent size and I'm not even like to the end of it, so... Yeah, I'm really going to like that because I like these matte, I love matte lipsticks. Because, yeah, matte's just my balm, my my go-to lip lipstick. I don't know what you call it. And then, oh, I forgot to show you. Um, this is the cute bag, what you got in Ipsy. Um, it's cute, but it feels really cheap. So... But if you have little kids and they like to play with certain stuff, it's really easy to give it to your nieces and nephews or your kids just to play with or bring. If you have like a go-to, you have to go to somewhere and you need a little snack, put your string cheese and your little snack foods in there. That would be good too. Or your makeup. <laughs> so, let's count. Yeah. Two, three... Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, overall, in two bags, I got ten products, and I only paid ten dollars for this subscription box. Each bag, it's not together, it's each bag, and I love how. It's $10 a month, but here's a little dipper. Uh, if you have oily, oily skin, like really bad skin, um, a lot of times Ipsy um, puts in like for all to skin types. With me, my skin's not the normal all to skin types. My Mine's very oily obsessive oily like very like it's uncontrollable a lot of times and this winter it's been so dry plus oily so I've been oily dry and then dry patches all around so it just hasn't been good and then my t-zone is not just like pores it's all around my skin's a very sensitive it's just not a good thing some days so when I get all skin types products in Ipsy, I get like my I cringe a little because I wish Ipsy would have like a certain like when you take your test that they would actually listen to the consumers and what really skin types they really have. So because even though this bag is ten dollars a month, you get really good products. It's kind of hard sometimes because products that you sometimes get, you don't even use. So that's actually wasting your $10. So I wish Ipsy would put in products that you'll actually use and love. So one thing, if you're going to get it, you will get some products that you don't like. So if you don't like it, pass it on or try it and see if you love it. But I know for sure my skin types, my skin type. And I wish that Ipsy would take that in con insert. I wish Ipsy would take it in consideration as people that do have oily skin and messed up skin. That would they say, let's try to fix that. Let's like find a way that would you know help their skin get better with products. And you know I love love matte lipstick, so I'm very happy. So what I'm happy about. 
<laughs> that is my rant for Ipsy. Okay, so I love this brush. I'm going to use it probably daily. I'm, I know I will. I love this eyeshadow. So I'm going to probably use the brown a lot. And I'm probably going to do the inner highlight as the inner corner highlight. I love these. So I'm going to use this one. Um, I'm actually probably going to... I'm going to use my lip balm and my lips, um, mini matte lip crayon. I know I'm going to use that. Um, I'm going to use this because I'm really interested. Uh, I really need some hydration under my eyes so and a lift because I'm getting older. And you all know that's not <laughs> a great thing sometimes. So I'm going to be liking that. Um... I'm interested in this, oops, the hydration one because this one did not work on me last time. And then I'm interested to see this eyeliner because it didn't move. And you know me, if you've been on my channel a lot, that my eyes water constantly and I need waterproof mascara, eyeliners, everything. And so it's really awesome that they put this in. I might keep this. I don't know. I will most likely give it away because I want to give it to someone that didn't get it in their Ipsy bag or doesn't have it and they want to try it out. So I'm most likely going to give it away, but uh, it's kind of like winging both ways. So I most likely will give it away. My rambling on <laughs> again. So. That is what I got in my Ipsy bag. I'm so excited because I got a lot of products I'm going to use. So um, I'll try to link a link below with Ipsy so you can check it out if you don't know what Ipsy is. Most people know what it is nowadays because it's Ipsy's like a high known Ipsy subscription bagging. I don't like boxing I don't know bag I like to say unbagging because it is a bag but I don't know what do you guys do do you guys say unbagging or unboxing let me know because I'm kind of like what do I say so yeah pretty colors love it love it love it good job Ipsy I'll see you guys later I'll see you guys later on the other side bye